Hi everybody, it's me, Arthur Shelley. I'm Arthur Chocolate, sorry. Everybody, it's me, Arthur Shelley. Hey guys, it's Charlene, and today we're going to be reacting to Angelina Jordan's Gloomy Sunday cover. Um, the song was originally sung by someone named, composed and sung by someone named Rezo Suras, and then covered by Billie Holiday, which became the more popular version. And, um... Now we're going to hear it by Angelina, who brings her own style, her own flavor, and her own energy to every song that she sings, right? Makes it her own. Um, someone was saying that we shouldn't call it a cover when Angelina does it. It becomes another original song, I guess, because she puts so much into it, you know? Um, but let me give you a quick history of the song. Here we go. Um, that song... Gloomy Sunday came to existence during one of history's bleakest moments, written in 1933 by Hungarian pianist and composer Rezo Ceres, hopefully I'm pronouncing that correctly, against the backdrop of the Great Depression and an increasing fascist influence in Hungary, and originally recorded in 1935 by Pal Kalmer. Kalma, excuse me, the song is something of a plea for mercy as humanity is at its worst. Ceres originally published lyrics were titled Vague a Vilagnac or The World is Ending and reflected a growing sense of horror and despair at the state of the world. A key sample lyric translates to Meadows are colored red with human blood. There are dead people on the streets everywhere. Wow, just to give a frame of reference for the level of darkness that Ceres's composition harbored. No one that's been blamed for anywhere between 17 and over 100 suicides. Wow, guys. To hear Gloomy Sunday is to be blanketed in tragic beauty. The song's minor key melody is at once incredibly catchy and ominously dark. Crafted to evoke a sense of despair that transcends language. Most music does. <laughs> While Ceres's song became an international hit, eventually being recorded by Billie Holiday in what's now probably the most famous version of the song, one need only hear the emotion in Kalma's gently aching voice to know the pain behind the verses. Okay, I'll stop there. Um, <clears throat> We're about to listen to it. I'm going to play a little bit of the Billie Holiday version, I think. Um, but we're about to listen to it sung by a a seven-year-old child I, I I can't imagine just based on the point of the song because I've heard Gloomy Sunday before have I ever listened actually listened to the lyrics I don't I don't think I have but um wow I can imagine a young child like this singing these lyrics this is the same thing I felt when I when I watched her sing um but I, you put a I put a spell on you. It was such a juxtaposition between the innocence of the person singing it and the the the, the severity of the lyrics, if I may say it that way. But um, here we go, guys. I've been having a lot of issues, guys, with being blocked by YouTube and copywriting. I was told that I need to pause every 30 seconds so that it doesn't register but that's very difficult to do because it, it, it really disrupts the flow of a reaction or or genuinely you're really listening to something you know to stop I'm not even aware of 30, when 30 seconds happens so I don't know I'm gonna have to figure something out right but it's kind of discouraging when you when you do a video which I love so much doing these videos love and then when I put it up, it gets blocked. Or it tells me infringement. Or it tells me, um, can it be monetized? And it's just, ah. Uh... But anyway, I love what I do. And um, hopefully, you guys love what I do too. And those of you who are not subscribed, please do. Because it would really help to build my numbers. I want to be able to do a live one day where we could all interact with one another and just chit chat a little and um you know as it stands my numbers are growing very very slowly which is something because sometimes i have these really huge numbers who have looked at a video 
and 90% according to my analytics 90% of the people who are looking are not subscribed so if that's you please subscribe all right and um, here we go we're gonna get into this this is gloomy Sunday Angelina Jordan and it's at no has got talent I believe and here we go hi son hi hi welcome in Hva heter du? Jeg heter Angelina jo Jordan. Hvor gammel er du? Jeg er syv år. Syv år, og hva er det du skal gjøre for oss her i dag? Jeg skal synge for dere. Hvilken sang da? Blommy Sunday fra Billy Holiday. Ok. Oi. Da gleder vi oss, Angelina. Da kan du bare sette i gang når du er klar. Scenen er din. So cute. I'll pause it. I paused for a second. Um, <laughs> first of all, can we talk about how extremely cute she is? I mean, like, <laughs> just want to eat her up. Um, wow. I, I, I think, you know, nobody's expecting a child to have that kind of soul. Yeah. And when you look at her, you, it's like the voice. I'm so sorry, guys. If you all hear noise, I'm having construction done, like I mentioned before. Oh my god, it's annoying. Yeah. But, um, yeah, let's get back into it. Because I'm going to mute myself so that you don't hear the noise. Okay? And here we go. My mouth is like that too. I'm gonna slap it. I know the judges are probably oh, gonna give her all like this. Oh <laughs> let me let it play for a little longer. Angelina? Yeah? Jeg tror at du er en gammel sjel som har levd mange liv. Ja. Du synger helt fantastisk. Jeg fikk gåsehud helt fra starten av. Jeg har ikke egentlig... Okay, let me just stop it there, guys, because again, with the copywriting, and I don't even know if the video I'm about to download has the um, translated, but he's talking about she's a young person in a, in a like, also in a little body, a tiny young body. Um, well, guys, I, you know, I wanted to say thank you, a special thank you to my subscribers or my faithful commenters who have been the ones who have been leading me to Angelina, to Dimash, and others, whom again I would never have looked at on my own. I um, 
like I said before, regardless of the copywriting and whatnot, I really enjoy looking at these artists. As a matter of fact, Dimash, Dimash's cover of SOS has become one of my favorite songs. I'm so sorry, guys, if you'll hear the the. It's so annoying. I'm sorry. Yeah, Dimash's SO cover of SOS has become one of my absolute favorite songs i mean when i say favorite i'm it's sung in french i hum along and um i listen to it every day i really really do i hear it in my head it has become an airworm it's just oh my god i never get tired of hearing it and i know this video is about angelina i'm sorry but i was just saying thank you to my to my wonderful subscribers thank you guys and commenters i appreciate it um my next reaction i've already lined up it's gonna be somebody i had never heard of before so it's not uh his name is teddy something i'm sorry i don't have it in front of me but yeah i've seen other reactors react to him and i had never heard of him before so and I've not watched anything of his, so I'm I'm interested to see him next. But remember to tell a friend, bring a friend, let's all be friends. If you're not subscribed, please subscribe. And please share the video if you like it. Even if you if you don't, still tell a friend about it, okay? So that I can build my subscribers and we can have a live one day. Alright? And until we see each other again, remember to love yourself. <laughs> love yourself, guys. Bye.